Audio Jungle. For centuries the word freak has been used cruelly to describe people born with abnormal features, or those able to perform extraordinary physical acts by contorting or misshaping their bodies. Freak shows were a particularly popular form of entertainment during the Victorian period, when exhibitions of life human curiosities had appeared in traveling fairs, circuses and taverns in England since the 1600s. These included so-called giants, dwarves, fat, thin people etc. The British Library in their Bodies of Knowledge section has collected some striking examples of advertising freak shows. From the Elephant Man to Lobster Boy, these stories are far more tragic than anyone realized at the time. Known to many as the Bearded Woman, Annie Jones toured with P.T. Barnum, becoming the country's top bearded lady and acting as a spokesperson for Barnum's Congress of Freaks. Born in Thailand in 1811, Cheng and Ng Bunker toured as a curiosity act for three years before settling down in North Carolina. They married a pair of sisters and fathered 21 children. Known as the Ohio Bigfoot Girl, Fanny Mill suffered from Milroy disease, which caused her legs and feet to become gigantic. Ehlers-Danlos Syndrome allowed Felix Werrell to stretch his skin to great length and take on the name Elastic Man. Better known as the Elephant Man, Joseph Merrick lived a tragic life. Rejected by his parents, he was left to join a touring freak show act. Grady Stiles Jr. aka Lobster Boy came from a long line of family members who suffered from the same birth defect that lent him his stage name. As an adult, he was an alcoholic and would eventually murder his daughter's fiancé. Billed as the living human skeleton Isaac Sprague began irreversibly losing weight at age 12 for reasons that remain unclear. The weight loss continued throughout adulthood until his untimely death. 1866 Russian performer Fader Hefty Chu went by the name Jojo the Dog-Faced Boy and became a star performer in P.T. Barnum's Sideshow. Years later, he was an influence on the physical characteristics of Chewbacca in Star Wars. Frank Lentini was born with a parasitic twin, ultimately leaving him with a third leg. When his family moved to the United States from Italy, Lentini entered showbiz as the Great Lentini, joining the Ringling Brothers Circus. George and Willie Muse were black albino identical twin brothers who had the misfortune of being born in the Jim Crow American South. They were kidnapped, told to grow out their hair and forced into the circus freak show Life as Men from Mars. Daisy and Violet Hilton were fused at the hip and put into a circus freak show at the age of three. Martin Lorelow, the human owl, could turn his neck a full 180 degrees. He appeared in Sam Wagner's freak show on Coney Island. Dubbed the four-legged girl from Texas, Myrtle Corbin was born with a severe congenital deformity that caused her to have two separate pelvises and a smaller set of legs. Born with a very rare orthopedic condition that caused her knees to bend backward, Ella Harper aka Camel Girl, received a $200 per week salary as the star of a touring freak show act. Mirandejo became famous for astounding the medical community by piercing his body with all kinds of objects seemingly without injury. However, this would ultimately prove to be his downfall when he died from swallowing a needle. Madame Gustica, who was billed as being from the Duckville tribe, 
is seen here smoking a pipe through the large plates in her lip. The Jaramillo sisters, Natalia and Aurora, were from Albuquerque, New Mexico. It remains unclear how exactly they first got into show business. Born without the lower half of his torso, Johnny Eck is seen here with Angelo Rosito in the film Freaks. He would also make several appearances as a bird creature in Tarzan movies. Minnie Woolsey, known as Cuckoo the Bird Girl, suffered from Seckel Syndrome, giving her both physical and mental disabilities. She lacked both teeth and hair and worked at a Coney Island sideshow until her death. Born into slavery, conjoined twins Millie and Christine McCoy would later be sold to the circus and travel the world for 30 years as a singing novelty act. Pascual Pignon toured the United States as the two-headed Mexican, decorating the tumor growing out of his head with a wax face. Charles Sherwood Stratton was paid $3 a week as a member of Barnum's Turing Act under the name Tom Thumb. He would eventually marry in 1863, pictured, before dying at the age of 45 two decades later. Born with a rare hypertrichosis or werewolf syndrome, Alice Doherty was put in a freak show by her mother at just two years old under the stage name Woolly Girl. Due to acromegalic gigantism, Jack Earl grew to 7 feet 7 inches tall. He traveled with Ringling Brothers and Barnum and Bailey Circus for 14 years before becoming a salesman. Audio Jungle
Thank you. 